Hello friends, welcome to my channel here at Keys. In this video, we can talk about HMR in Angular 19. So first we can talk about what is HMR, then we can see some use cases. So first let me tell you what is this HMR, okay? So this HMR stands for Hot Model Replacement. This is the development technique that allows developers to replace models or components of an application during runtime without losing the current application state. So the idea is very simple. As per the developer point of view, whenever we made any changes for verifying whether the changes are reflected in our application, we may refresh our page or component. Okay. So since we are applying this HMR, instead of completely reloading our page or a component, we can refresh the certain areas. Okay. So let me show you from the code. So I just created one new component. Okay. Here I am adding one h2 tag. Okay. And adding one input control. So if you look at the UI side, we can see one small text box. I am just entering some values. Okay. So after that, I realized I want to make some more changes. I made some changes once I saved we can see the new changes at, at the same time my data are vanished okay so similarly again I am entering some values right and I am making some changes my TS side here I am declaring one constructor okay once I saved see again the data got vanished okay so as of now in this angular uh, hmr is enabled for the css side okay so whenever we making any changes related to the css it's not going to refresh the complete component instead of that it will reflect in the certain areas so let me show you i'm creating one new class red this is one class okay Next in our title section, I'm including this class, right? Oh, it's not reflected. Okay. See now it is reflected, okay. So next what I'm going to do, let me enter some values. Okay. Now I'm making some small changes in our CSS section. So instead of red, I am changing this into green. See you now, it got changed, but at the same time, still our state remains. Okay. So similarly, adding center and changing the font size. Okay. So whatever change I added in the CSS section, it's reflected, still the data is remains. The reason is the HMR is enabled. So now you may have a question, how to configure this HMR? So now you may have a question, how to enable this HMR, okay? So the thing is, currently we are in Angular 19. In Angular 19, defaultly, this HMR is enabled, okay? So if you want to disable this HMR, uh, we have two options. Uh, one is like, when we are running this application, we have to include uh, no HMR flag. Otherwise, we have to make one small change in our angular.json side, okay? Let me show you one by one. So first, let me stop this application, okay? So normally, uh, we will execute this ng serve or npm start. I am executing this ng serve command. For the short form, we can use the s also, okay? And then, use no hmr, okay? Okay, again, our application in running mode. And I just refreshed. Okay, and entering some value. Okay, and I'm trying to make some changes here. Okay, I'm changing this into yellow. Once I saved, see now, the change is reflected at the same time, 
our data got vanished. Okay. The response is same. Okay. At the same time, if I'm running normally with the ng serve command. So now if I'm making some changes, See, the values are there okay this is the one way and another way is uh, from our angular.json side if you look at the serve section we have this production development so in this development side because uh, this feature is only for the development so here we can include one new flag hmr and we can say false if you not provide anything defaultly it should be true since we made a config level changes need to stop and rerun now i am entering some values and in the css side see now it's reflected at the same time data is vanished okay so i know it's very small concept but it is useful for the developers when we are making a design level changes so now we are in the end of the video still if you have any doubts or clarification please post in the comment box and also please don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you thanks for watching